everyone, Farmer Kate here from Cannon Hall Farm and today I have the really good job of taking the lovely Pip here for a walk. So Farmer Rob isn't here today so I've got the job of taking care of this very important girl. I really really do love Pip the dog here, I've always had dogs my whole life and while Farmer Rob's away he's asked me to look take care of Pip which has been really really nice. She is such a sweet dog and we get to go on like lots of walks so it's quite, quite a good day at work for me. My plan for today, we're gonna go around maybe this top field here, give her a good run around. I like to take her kind of off the lead there so she can run around where there's like no cows or no tractors and no animals. And then she's a really, really good dog around animals. So we might see like a few animals like our cows or something. She'd just like to say hi to. Let's go, come on. Good girl. Good girl. I've had a chat with Farmer Rob and her training is going really well. We have to be slightly careful at certain times of the year with our sheep. So when our ewes are heavily pregnant, they don't really want to be run around the field by a dog in training if it's like not necessary. So we are kind of easing up a little bit on that side of things, but from what she has been doing, she's doing really, really well. It's also important that she's not only herding the sheep, but she's getting used to other animals around the farm, like our cows and our alpacas, and she kind of knows that they're not for her, they're not to be herded, but she can go up, give them a sniff, see what's going on, and we're happy for her to do that. There is no sheep in this field today. They're all kind of inside getting ready for lambing. So it does give us a good opportunity to let Pip have a run out, run out and get some energy burned off. Anyway, she looks ready to go, so let's see her have a little run. You ready, girl? Go on then. Go. Oh, Pip. Come on, you can do it. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Good girl. I think she can smell the sheep that were in this field. So she's a bit confused about where they are. So when we're out and about like walking Pip, she's always like looking to work. She's looking for some sheep and she's always like ready for action. But today there's gonna to be no work for her to do. It's all about having fun and letting her run off some steam. So I think we're gonna take her to see the cows next. Pip, you ready? Good girl. I think, shall we go see Ted? Check on him. Come on girl. So Ted is hiding away there at the back, but we've got Fern up at the front, as she always is usually eating some hair. So let's see what Pip thinks. Come on. What's that? Who's this? It's nice. It's the cow. All right, so Ted here has made an appearance. Now, Pip, you can probably tell, like, she's not too keen on the cows. She's just keeping a distance which is kind of what we want. We want it to be like well-mannered and things, especially around the cows who are pregnant. We don't want her running up and suddenly scare them. So she's perfectly happy to kind of be around the cows. She just doesn't show much interest in them. I think Pip has had a really good time on her walk today. She's met some animals and I think she's quite tired out now. So I better pop her back home. I really hope you've enjoyed seeing this little update about Pip, our wonderful sheepdog. So thank you so much for more watching. And from me and her, we'll see you later. Bye.